In the last few years, computer-aided design software has evolved in a very rapid way. So many pieces of software have been made to fulfill the market's needs. Today, we will try to give you a detailed comparison between two of the most known software, so you can decide which one suits you the best before purchasing it. Katia, computer-aided three-dimensional interactive application, is a multi-platform CAD, CAM, and CAE commercial software developed by the French company Dassault Systems. The software was developed to use in different industries and to design all types of rich and complex designs. Inventor is a computer-aided three-dimensional software that it is provided by Autodesk. It is highly recommended by designers because the company tried to make it on a level where prototyping would be like a piece of cake, especially for beginners. It makes all products life cycle easy to be generated in no time and with no cost or physical machining until everything is finally tested on the software and approved. These two pieces of software are both leaders in the three-dimensional designing world. They are used by several industries, but they have a great deal of non-similarity that makes them almost incompatible. Pricing is the first and the greatest difference between them. Inventor is very cheap compared to Katia. Even its lowest cost license have a big variety of features that makes it possible to get your work done, not to mention the high cost license for professionals and big companies, which is also cheap compared to Katia's. Inventor provides the free trial and like Katia, but both pieces of software provide a student license. It is the cheapest one with the fewest features possible. Katia is more expensive with base or standard versions. However, it offers a lot of features. Inventor provides catalogs of standard mold bases and components, so you don't have to spend time modeling them. You can create a wide range of complex geometries by easily combining solids and surfaces. It gives you precise control of shape characteristics, advanced modeling tools, and manufacturing ready-to-use parts. Working with parts that are based on mechanical relationships rather than on geometric descriptions like lines, arcs, and circles allows you to stay away from constraints, working with much freedom on 2D drafting and 3D modeling as well as accelerating your work. On the other hand, Katia has better surface modeling modules maybe the best in 3D CAD market. It has more advanced surfacing workbenches for conceptual modeling and class A modeling, which you will not find in Inventor. It is much easier to use and more powerful. Modeling in Katia takes less time. With very limited animation and almost no real-world physics capabilities, Inventor software provides animated visualizations of 3D model. With the analysis output, the user can select different ways to view results to make it easier to understand and visualize complex problems. That way, you can focus on specific components of the design to see how they appear. Katia does a better job with physics, but if the users hope for fully animated model, they will require another piece of CAD software. You don't need to be a simulation expert to effectively simulate and optimize designs. Their easy-to-use and tightly integrated motion simulation and stress analysis in both software help the designers predict how their design will work in real-world conditions before building it. That helps to quickly understand the design's behavior, including the position, velocity, and accelerations of the moving parts. With the power of the modern computers and the advanced rendering features included with Inventor and Katia software, it's easy to create realistic images and videos that permit people without engineering experiences to understand engineering illustrations to eventually visualize the design. These pieces of software eliminate the high costs of prototyping and product photography with high-quality, photorealistic renderings and animations. They provide design engineers with tools they need to quickly create renderings and animations. 
These pieces of software products include an intuitive parametric design environment for developing initial concept sketches and kinematic models of parts and assemblies. They automate the advanced geometry creation of intelligent components, such as plastic parts, steel frames, rotating machinery, tube and pipe runs, electrical cables and wires, not to mention their high-productivity 2D mechanical drafting tool. These pieces of software reduce the geometry burden, so the engineers can rapidly build and refine digital prototypes that validate design functions and help minimize manufacturing costs. Inventor is the kind of software that was developed to be used by all kind of designers, from small industries to big ones, because of the many features it offers. Katia, on the other hand, is more a high-scale production speciality. It was mainly segmented through aircraft manufacturers and all type of big industries that actually afford its pricing. Both pieces of software are user-friendly, with a simple interface where you can find tools easily. Inventor eliminates the interruption that prevents you from making progress. The command you need shows up right at the cursor, and you can easily make changes without having to hunt for the right feature or fight with existing geometry and constraints. But in Katia, you won't find similar tools grouped in one row as in Inventor, which makes it a bit more time-consuming for designers, but once you get familiar with it, it will become easier. So, they don't actually take so much time to learn them, but you can find all necessary data online with tutorials or even reviews, which makes the process less troubling. Katia and Inventor both run on Windows. Lastly, we can just add a small note on Katia's evolution, which has been very slow compared to Inventor's. Major revisions only occur once or twice a decade, with only service upgrades in between. When they push a new version, the difference is so striking that it looks like a whole new application.